Well, guys, there was some new information released about the Las Vegas massacre that took place at the Jason Aldean concert. When I first heard about this, I'm not going to lie, it sent chills uh, down my spine. And apparently, about 45 minutes before the concert took place, there was an unidentified woman had apparently gone up to another woman there and warned them her and many others around her that they were all going to die again this was about 45 minutes before the cut well really before the the shooting took place uh, concert had already been kind of going on but about 45 minutes before the shooting took place um, here's what here's exactly what down one woman who was at the route 91 music festival claimed that an unidentified woman had told other concert goers that they were all going to die after pushing her way up to the front of the venue. Now, you know, imagine what they must have been thinking. Now, the witness, age 21, had told the local news, quote, she had been messing with the lady in front of her and telling her she was going to die and that we were all going to die. They escorted her out to make her stop messing around with all the other people, but none of us knew it was actually going to be serious. She described the lady as being Hispanic, and the lady was also escorted from the venue along with another man. Now, the unnamed witness who was attending the event on her 21st birthday described the pair as short, both around 5 feet, 5 inches tall, uh, and look just like everyday uh people so I, I mean the question I have is and 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 the girl apparently said she added that she and her friends had just made it back to their hotel room uh, when the gunfire started so you no know, did they heed the warnings of this woman what did this woman know I mean you got some random woman who's walking through the crowd and telling them that they are all going to die it just it, it it shakes me to my core. It's eerie. It's creepy. I, I just I don't know how to explain it. Maybe even demonic, in, in some sense. You know I I don't. You know was she issuing a warning? Obviously she's issuing a warning or something like that. But I mean, did she know about it? Um, the woman was escorted out. I don't know if she's a person of interest in this or not, or if police are going to be investigating her. I just found it very weird, and something just hasn't sat well with me, guys, throughout this whole Las Vegas incident. Um, it's just something does not sit right in my spirit about it. Be in prayer. Uh, I hope it seems like there may be something more sinister uh, beyond this. You know, did the shooter, Stephen Paddock, did, was there others involved? Did somebody put him up to this? You know, was he working for somebody? What is really going on? Only God knows. But I'm telling you what, guys, we're living in times that I never thought, I mean, I would see. We're living in the last days, and Jesus Christ is coming back soon. People are confused. They're taking a look at the news. They're saying these earthquakes are happening everywhere. Volcanoes are erupting. Hurricanes. Just mass, just violence everywhere. Terrorism. Political turbulence. All the things that Jesus talked about were going to happen before his return. Be in prayer, guys. If you're watching this video right now, if you've never received Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, let today be the day of salvation. Please let me know. I would love to pray with you if you would like to accept Christ as your Lord and Savior. You could be born again, forgiven of all of your sins. You could come into the kingdom of God today where you will have everlasting life and a home in heaven for eternity. Also, if you prefer, you can email me directly, cardsfan480 at gmail.com. That's cardsfan480 at gmail.com. You can write me there, and I would love to pray with you. If you have a prayer request, too, please let me know. You can also write me about that. All right, guys? Again, just be in prayer. I'll continue here to keep you up to speed on all the latest breaking news, prophecy headlines, and current world events. I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please. Be safe out there. Don't forget to share these videos with your friends and family. God bless each and every single one of you, and I'll talk with you soon.